Terrahawks, stay on this channel. This is an emergency. You say the Mars 2020 expedition is maintaining a planned radio silence? Yes, as part of a test program. <laughs> Do you expect my 100 million readers to believe that? I'm accusing NASA of a cover-up. Oh, nonsense. I believe the base on Mars has been attacked, possibly destroyed. I believe the Earth itself may well be threatened. Pure speculation. I'm convinced a defense organization has been set up to counter the threat. He said in his column he was going to drop a bombshell tonight. I think it could be coming up right now. I believe the name of the organization is Terrahawks. No comment? Certainly I'll comment. On behalf of Nasser, I would like to issue a blanket denial of all theories produced without a shred of evidence. What about Terrahawks? What about some solid evidence? I'll get the proof, and when I do, I'll tell the world. The people have the right to know. Flaming thunderbolts. Where did he get our name? I don't know, but one thing I do know, that man could be a threat to our entire security. Back to hawk nests, huh? All right, Hudson, as fast as you can. Another beautiful day, Tiger. Why are we on a 10.30? We're on standby because this long dry spell is creating some freak interference in communications. What's the problem? Hero's got a possible contact, but we can't get clearance from commercial space control. We need the clearance, CSC. We're doing all we can. Contact confirmed and in range. Request clearance to fire. There is a space freighter in the area, but CSC are getting a double echo. You mean there may be two ships? Yeah, and one of them could be Zelda using the freighter as a cover. Target will be out of range in 15 seconds. Permission to fire. You can't take the chance. We have a 10 second fire window left. For space sake. Five, four, 10-0. Let it go, hero. If it was Zelda's ship, it's through. If my theory is correct, the Terrahawks would need an elaborate and highly secretive supply system. I have a possible lead which... Lightning, and close, but no thunder. What you need, Daryl, old sport, is a drink. Better make that a double.
Who's there? Come out. I know you're there. Put the gun down. Who are you? My name is Zelda. Drop the gun. Do as my mother says. Now we can talk, Mr. Darrell. You know me? Oh, yes. We monitored your TV performance. It was most absorbing. What do you want? I find we have a mutual interest. The Terrorhawk Organization. You've broken into my house. I'm warning you, there's an automatic alarm system. The police will be on their way. My mother can control matter. You will notice she is not wet from the rain. The alarm will not help you. We both want the Terra Hawks. We are going to help each other. Bring him to the ship. Major? Yes, Mom? When he has a free moment, tell Dr. Einstein. I heard that. Tell him what? I was speaking to the Sergeant Major. Don't you think you're overreacting a little? You disciplined Hawkeye without hearing his side of the story. Seven days loss of privilege for failing to log a service report? It may not have been his fault. It was his responsibility. You must be fair. I'm not here to be fair. I'm here to ensure Terrorhawks is an efficient fighting unit at all times. I just like to see fair play. Then see my side of it too, huh? All right. What did you want to tell me? The supply overlander has reached section four. Great. Let's hope they remember to pack my lobster claws this trip. Oh, Tiger, you're incorrigible. Mary. You're a day at the beach. Ready for liftoff, sir. 1050. 1010. Set course for rendezvous point. ETA, 64 minutes. It's a pity you can't talk. You could tell me about your hag of a mistress. All right, no offense intended. I'll tell you one thing. I don't trust her. All that idiot's son. But I made a deal, and I'll keep it. You certainly will, Daryl. You certainly will. Where's the Overlander? Eight miles due north, right on schedule. Lower the cargo door. Stand by to receive the Overlander. So. Sure. 
Here it comes. Overlander. It stopped. Complete electronic failure. Where is it? Four miles due north. We'd better get out there. Wait. It's moving again. Is it now? Two miles and closing fast. I don't like it. There it is. It looks like a runaway. It's no runaway, it's under manual control. What? Someone's driving it. I was close. Too close. Trying to ram us. Close the cargo door. 10 10. Get Battle Tank out there. Zero, tell Battle Tank to head it off. So. Tell Battle Tank to open fire. Yes, sir. comes again. 1050. Now that was close. Sensors indicate 7.3 centimeters clearer, sir. Uh, thank you, Zero. Tell Battle Tank not to let it get away. I want whoever's behind that wheel. Yeah. Yes, sir.
right where you are. Well, well, Mr. Mark Darrell. I see you've made some new friends. Bad choice. On your feet. You've got some questions to answer. A lot of questions. I'm telling you the truth. I swear it. All I wanted was a story. I don't buy it, Daryl. I don't buy any of it. Why do you assume everything he says is a lie? Because that's the safe option. Lock him up. Right. Let's get rolling. First cubes, now balls. I'll come quietly. The safe option. What about fair play? What about justice? That's a luxury I can't afford. You're condemning Daryl without any real evidence or proof. He's a threat to our entire security. He was following a story. He's a reporter. He tried to ram us. In my book, that's attempted murder. Then he should stand trial. How can he go into open court with what he knows? So you're to be the judge and jury? Who else is there? What's the sentence? Why don't you go all the way? Eliminate Daryl, and you eliminate all security risk. That's a really safe option. Hey, what about a drink of water? I can't leave my post. These bars look like tungsten steel. I'm not going anywhere. I'll watch him. Go and get some water. Yes, ma'am. Thanks. How's the arm? Better. Much better. What's that, Zero? Daryl's loose, sir. Flaming thunderbolts. Let's go. You're right, man. I'll be fine. Stay here in case he tries to double back. I'm going after him. What happened? I was getting water. You left your post, lad? Miss Falconer told me. Mary's down here? Yes, sir. She went after the prisoner. Daryl, I want to talk to you. Sure. Come in, Einstein, but alone. You stay here, Zero.
This whole place goes up and there's nothing you can do about it. Hold it, right there. Move back, Daryl. I said, move back. I'm trying to. I seem to be held in some sort of force field. Don't buy it, Mary. I'm trying to break it. Mary, fire. Give me a chance. You wouldn't shoot a man in cold blood. For space sake, Mary, don't trust him. I'm, I'm going to turn the detonator off. Don't shoot. <sighs> Take a look at him, Mary. I don't want to. I killed him. Take a look. He was an android. Right. And you knew? Well, I had this theory. You were right all along. I'm sorry. To say that one small word takes a mighty big person. Tiger, you're a day at the beach. Mary, you're incorrigible. Mm.